On the phone right now, we've got actor, musician, and playwright Jeff Daniels, who will be appearing at the Washington Pavilion on Monday, November 8th. Good morning, Jeff. How you doing? Fantastic. Uh, where are you calling from this morning? I'm in a truck stop in New Jersey. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I know. Yeah, 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 you can probably smell it from where you are. <laughs> now, you're coming to Sioux Falls again on Monday, November 8th. For those who maybe have been in a cave for a while, Jeff, you've been in tons of movies, plays, uh, things like Terms of Endearment, The Purple Rose of Cairo, Fly Away Home, etc., Gettysburg, and, uh, of course, Dumb and Dumber. Tell me about your theater company. Well, the Purple Rose Theater Company is in Chelsea, Michigan. It's 20 years old. It's a nonprofit professional theater company. We do a lot of new plays, a lot of comedies in particular, and uh, it's work. It's something that that part of the country really likes, and... Uh, you know, we're 20 years later, we'll st we're still there. So I sell CDs from the music I play. The CDs I sell, any money I make, make from the CDs goes to the theater company. So that's the way to kind of help raise money. Speaking of the CDs, uh, are there two CDs out now or three? Well, there's four. We kind of just put them up on the website at jeffdaniels.com and, and kind of let them kind of, whoever finds them, you know, downloads them but uh yeah you know, there's four of them there's probably going to be five by the end of the year now the first thing that that hit me when i listened to uh the one that i listened to yesterday is you're a really good guitar player did you uh oh, thanks. Did, thanks. W when did you start playing um i bought a guitar in 1976 when i moved to new york to uh chase the acting career and and just have kind of you know used it as I've, i fiddled with it i really kind of just figured, tried to figure out how to play it and and just stayed at it and, and really enjoyed it. And, and then, uh, you know, so now it's been, I don't know, 30 plus years. So, uh, it, it wasn't until about 10 years ago that I started playing in front of people. And initially that was to raise money for the Purple Rose Theater Company. But now I, I enjoy it so much. I'm running around the country doing it. And, uh, did I hear you playing Dobro as well on there? Yeah, I can, uh, I can do some slide guitar. Yeah, I enjoy that. Although the stage, you now, when I look to your website and they show the stage, it has a very Neil Young solo act feel to it. But uh, you tell a lot of, of stories and things like that. Are we going to expect a lot of comedy at the show on Monday? Yeah, my primarily I'm there to entertain them. And uh, I, I really uh, I, I, I make them laugh, certainly from movies like Dumb and Dumber and, and things like that. They, that's what they expect, and so that's what I, I give them. And I enjoy doing that. I love, you know, comedy and making people laugh, but... And that sets up kind of the more serious ones and the guitar songs where the guitar is featured and all that. But primarily, I'm there to make them laugh harder than they have in a long time. Uh, one of them in particular struck me. Um, you talk about meeting George Harrison. Can you tell that story a little bit? Yeah, I did a movie called Checking Out back in 1988, and it was produced by a company that George Harrison owned. And as we were shooting the movie in Los Angeles, you, everybody was kind of hoping that he might show up. And sure enough, he did, just to say hello, and got to meet him. And I asked him if he wouldn't mind signing the guitar I had, which was in the dressing room, and he said he'd be happy to. So he, we went into a back room, and he signed it. And then he flipped it over and played Here Comes the Sun, just sitting there right in front of me. And uh, it was just such a gift and such a, I mean, it was one of the great moments of my life. So have you touched that guitar since? <laughs> oh, yeah. What I, what I do, I don't have it on this tour because the guitar is so valuable. I can't possibly let it out of my sight with his signature and what he did on it. But, but when I'm, you know, at the Purple Rose shows, I'll sometimes tell the story and then I'll play Here Comes the Sun on that guitar. How long is the show going to be, roughly? That's an hour and a half. Tickets are 25 or $30 by contacting the Pavilion box office? It's a lot of fun. and. A lot of the comedy, you know, is, is some of the songs are like the Dirty Harry Blues, mm -hmm. which is a, a song about, I did a movie with Clint Eastwood where he shot and killed me, so wrote a song about that experience. <laughs> and, um, you know, road rage, you know, I've never been a, very good at road rage, you know, where you pull up next to somebody at 90 miles an hour and try to have a angry conversation with them. So I just wrote a song that kind of is, is my one-liner to anyone who does something to me on the road, which is, have a good life than die. So <laughs> those end up becoming coming songs. And, be, you know, in the way, it's, it's kind of everybody thinks that, but nobody says it in this way. And so that's when the song really, really is funny. One more question, Jeff, and we'll let you go on because I know you're a busy guy. What movie do people approach you and quote most often? 
Uh, it's Dumb and Dumber. I mean, certainly that's the one that uh, uh, has reached the biggest. I mean, that's from 7 to 70. I've had guys in their 70s come up to me and very quietly say, you know, that movie is my favorite movie. And I said, sir, what you're telling me is that that movie is your Citizen Kane. <laughs> so they, there are Getty, the Gettysburg probably gets some reaction. And, and then it starts, you know, they, there's so many that, it, that they pop up once in a while. But Dumb and Dumber is the one. Well, we appreciate you taking some time and spending it with us today, Jeff, and we'll see you when you get here to Sioux Falls. Thanks, guys. Appreciate it.